My name is Michelle. I'm 17 and weigh 300 pounds. My whole life I've been bullied because of my weight. I didn't have many friends or a boyfriend. I was lonely, obese, and felt miserable at times. I was always bullied in school until I decided to take control of my life. Lose weight, become fit, and find the man of my dreams. This is my journey from fat to all that. I was always the biggest kid in my school, which made me an easy target for bullies. I never fought back. I was a shy, nice kid, never a fighter. I tried dieting and working out, but my body fought against me and I couldn't seem to get it right. By the time I reached high school, I topped 300 pounds. Having PCOS made it extremely difficult to lose weight. To cope, I started emotionally eating. That's when the bullying got even worse. One day, a girl I used to call my best friend was picking on me. Finally, I'd had enough and fought back. Only I was the one who got suspended. Talk about unfair. That night, I looked at myself in the mirror. I hated what I saw and realized enough was enough. I had to stop making excuses, stop letting the bullies get me down, and start taking control of my life right now. My first step was meeting with a doctor. My doctor suggested weight loss surgery. Not knowing what it was or what life had planned for me, I decided to put my name on a wait list. I knew I could use the time to get in better shape, so I joined the closest gym. Walking through those doors for the first time, I was so scared. I had no idea what I was doing or how to use any of the machines, but there was no turning back. Those first workouts were hard as hell, but I pushed myself. Even when I felt like I couldn't do one more rep, I kept going. And you know what? After six months, I lost 40 pounds and felt terrific. I also realized the gym was in a scary place, and I couldn't believe how much I loved going. Since I was doing so well, my doctor gave me the go-ahead for gastric surgery. I was so excited to finally get the procedure, and I'm happy to report it went off without a hitch. Once she cleared me, me to work out again, I raced back to the gym. Only now, I had a new goal. Drop 60 pounds by my high school graduation, which was just six months away. I was extremely committed to always showing up, going late on school nights. After long hours of work on weekends, I hit the gym anytime I could. No excuses, no holding back. And by graduation, I'd done it. I lost the 60 pounds. That was a total of 100 pounds gone. Better celebrate! I looked good too, and that only inspired me to keep going. One day at the gym, I started chatting with a guy. I felt like he really liked me. Pretty soon, we started hanging out and working out together. Then we started dating, and he became my very first boyfriend. With my boyfriend by my side, I wanted to push myself further, so I set another goal. Lose 45 pounds in three months. It was ambitious, but I knew I could do it. I increased my cardio, added more weights to my workouts, and I killed each session at the gym. Those 45 pounds melted off. And for the first time in my life, when I looked in the mirror, I truly loved myself. Then suddenly, without a warning, my world turned upside down. Out of nowhere, he left me. He didn't call me. He didn't warn me. Nothing. I was devastated. But this time, instead of turning for food for comfort like the old me would have, I doubled down at the gym. I sweated out my pain. I worked through my heartache and my doubts. It was proof I was truly becoming a new, healthier me on the outside and the inside. By now, I'd lost 145 pounds. But there there was something I hadn't lost, all my extra skin. There was a lot of it, and it was hiding all my new muscle, so I had surgery to remove it. So all of this loose skin is going to come off. Now I was ready to push my body to the next level. I decided to shift my goals. I'd focus less on losing weight and more on building muscle, on gaining definition, so I stacked on even heavier weights, added more reps, and pushed myself beyond my limits. Over the next eight months, my body began to transform even more. I focused on specific muscles groups, sculpting my arms, legs, and back. I looked and felt amazing. It was then I started posting my journey online. I was shocked with the response I got. Hundreds of thousands of people wanted to hear my story. They asked for tips on living a healthier lifestyle like mine. When you're having those cravings, pause. Ask yourself, does future me agree with this? Today's video is going to be a highly requested one. It felt amazing to inspire so many people. One of them was this guy named Elijah. He DM'd me many times and I finally responded. When we actually met in person, we really hit it off. Before we knew it, we were working out together. We'd push each other. We'd hold each other accountable. We fell in love. We moved in together and recently welcomed a baby boy to our family. You bet I'm so crushing it in the gym, even with my baby bump and now in postpartum. Don't worry, I've checked with my doctor and I'm all cleared and safe. 
I know how important it is to live a healthy life. For me, my baby, and my family. My name is Michelle. I used to weigh 300 pounds. Through hard work and dedication, I took control of my life. I left behind those who didn't support me, dropped 145 pounds, gained serious muscle, and found true love. I created the life I've always dreamed of because I am strong, I am powerful, and I am unstoppable. I am superhuman.